There is yet another way the Lord will magnify you in your call to his service. You will feel at some time, perhaps at many times, that you cannot do all you feel you must. The heavy weight of your responsibilities will seem too great. You will worry that you can't spend more time with your family. You will wonder how you can find the time and the energy to meet your responsibilities beyond your family and your calling. You may feel discouragement and even guilt after you have done all you could to meet all your obligations. I have had such days and such nights. Let me tell you what I have learned. It is this. If I only think of my own performance, my sadness deepens. But when I think that the Lord promised that his power would go with me, I begin to look for evidence of what he has done in the lives of the people I am to serve. I pray to see with spiritual eyes the effects of his power. Then, invariably, the faces of people flood back into my memory. I remember the shine in the eyes of my child whose heart was softened, the tears of happiness on the face of a girl on the back row of a Sunday school class I was teaching, or a problem that was resolved before I had time to get to it. I know then that I have done enough for the promise made by the Joseph Smith to be filled once again. Let us cheerfully do all things that lie in our power, and then may we stand still with the utmost assurance to see the salvation of God and for his arm to be revealed. You can have the utmost assurance that your power will be multiplied many times by the Lord. All he asks is that you give your best effort and your whole heart. Do it cheerfully and with the prayer of faith.